Russian war correspondents are hysterically insulting residents of the Kursk and Belgorod regions and accusing them of treason because of their attitude towards the Russian army. One of the Russian propagandists recorded a video in which he uses obscene language about the residents of the two regions listed above saying that they do not allow Russian soldiers to move into the homes of the locals and do not provide them with food and water. Do you really want to win the war? It sounds disgusting when you do not sell water to soldiers because you are afraid that soldiers will come to you and something will fly there. This is pure treason. You are a counter-revolutionary. If a soldier came to your house and said that there will be a stronghold here, then you take your things and run off to your relatives. This is pure counter-revolution. The propagandist is indignant. He also accused Belgorod residents of taking advantage of this situation and renting apartments to Putin's military and Z-War correspondents at sky-high prices. You are spies of a foreign country, you are not people, the propagandist added furiously. Recalled Z-War correspondents admitted that the Russian army is unable to regain control over the lost territories of the Kursk region. Meanwhile, the mood of the residents of the part of Kursk region occupied by the Ukrainian armed forces is changing dramatically. Young people are asking for evacuation to Ukraine, not wanting to remain in dictatorial Russia, and older people are cursing Putin, who unleashed the war. A war correspondent, Andrei Saplienko, says that residents of Sudza in the Kursk region, under the influence of Russian propaganda at the beginning of the offensive operation of the Ukrainian armed forces in the region, thought that fascists were coming and hid in basements and forest belts, but when they saw that the created Ukrainian military commandment's office was providing all the necessary assistance to the locals, their mood changed. It's impressive how the new Ukrainian commandment's office on Russian territory helps people. Products, water, medicines, essential items. Everything is brought here from Ukraine. Ukrainian doctors even saved a woman in labor and a newborn baby. The journalist says, Плак не видно, да, ни хрена? Сейчас нормально поливают. Продолжение